Hi everyone, it's me. <laughs> Good morning friends, it is Saturday morning. We are going to start the day with some breakfast, which is Thai leftovers. <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna do kind of a realistic update on what my fitness and health journey looks like right now. And I feel like a very fitting way is to start with some leftovers for breakfast. So let's start the day. <laughs> A beautiful thing, leftovers for breakfast. Tell them about how your boyfriend ate them cold because he couldn't wait. <laughs> well, you just told them. <laughs> and excuse you, you're my fiance. <laughs> oh, it's good warm. You should have warmed yours up. So we have pineapple fried rice and we have had CU, I think this one's called. It's like the thick, they call it drunken noodles. Mmm, I love noodles. So I'm gonna eat this and then I'm gonna have a chat with you guys. All right, let's catch up with a glass of greens. I've been taking these every day as like an experiment for another video, which I don't think will be posted by the time this one's up. So if you're interested to see if greens actually does anything, subscribe, because <laughs> that video is coming up. Anyways, okay, how am I doing with my fitness journey? I feel like naturally in the summertime, things get a little more relaxed in terms of like your workout schedule, in terms of like scheduling in general. Things get kind of hectic over the summer, I think, especially with weekend plans. You know, everyone wants to make use for the summer. <laughs> That's been kind of like our theme for the summer. Every single time it's nice outside, we're like, we have to make use. <laughs> but yeah, because we're spending so much time, especially on the weekends, going out, doing fun things, spending time in the sun, it doesn't leave as much room for like your workout or for like, if you're like a strict meal planner, that kind of stuff. But I think that's okay. And I think that's what a lot of us go through in the summer. So what I've been doing lately, well, for like the past two months to combat that, if I'm not trying like a specific workout program for YouTube to show you guys, my workout schedule generally is like Monday to Thursday, I'll have active days. I'll do various things from like weight training to Pilates to cardio. And then Friday, I'll take a rest day. Saturday, I'll also take a rest day. So two rest days in a row. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and then depending how I'm feeling on Sunday or how busy we are, sometimes I'll even take Sunday as a rest day as well, but it's kind of a flex day. Like sometimes I do work out on Sundays. So yeah, sometimes I even take three rest days in a row. And if you're kind of in that same boat and you're wondering like if you're doing something wrong or if you're worried that you're not like motivated anymore, I don't think you should be. I think that's just a seasonal thing. We just get busier in the summer. At least I do. Like I thrive in the summer. <laughs> and then in the winter, I hermit and then I can spend all the the time in the world working out if I want to. <laughs> so yeah, that's kind of where I'm at right now. I've also been a little less strict with myself on the duration of my workouts. I do try and stick to 30 minutes a day on my active days, but sometimes if I find a good 20 minute hit workout and just do that, that is perfectly fine. That is more than fine. <laughs> and I've been feeling great. Like I haven't noticed any like decline in my physique or how I'm feeling or how strong I am or how fit I am. I literally just feel the same. If anything, I feel stronger. <laughs> and yeah, in general, I feel like I've also been eating out a lot more on the weekends, like meeting with friends for dinner, going out for drinks, going to like patios, or just like enjoying a can of something at home. I feel like that used to make me feel kind of guilty, but we gotta live a little sometimes and there's nothing to feel guilty about. So yeah, that's kind of how I'm doing right now. I'm still obviously, you know, trying to aim for 30 minutes of movement five times a week. During the week, my meals just generally still are quite structured. I meal prep all of my lunches. I cook all of my breakfasts and dinners from like Monday to Thursday. And then on the weekend, we kind of let loose and we have fun. <laughs> so yeah, if you're feeling like you're struggling, you're not, you're fine. It's the summer, enjoy your life. We will have so much time in the winter when it's like miserably cold outside and snowy and we don't want to do anything. There will be plenty of time for that. So <laughs> enjoy the weather while it lasts. Okay. <laughs> so today's Saturday, it's a rest day. We'll see what happens tomorrow, but I'm just going to hang out with you guys for a couple days and show you what I do. <laughs> so I also did want to mention that today's video is sponsored by Halara. I am so excited about the sponsor because I have been shopping this brand for a long time now. And when they reached out, I was like, 
Really? Like, I actually really like your clothing. So if you haven't heard of Halara, they are an activewear, but also like athleisure brand. I feel like they focus on making like activewear kind of cute. <laughs> They're definitely like full on on that like tennis skirt, tennis dress trend that's like so popular right now, which I love because why not wear a skirt or a dress while you're working out? So yeah, basically everything I wear in this video will be Halara. So if you see anything that you like I will have a discount code I think okay yeah my discount code is Jamie F1 and that'll get you a 20% off things at Halara <laughs> so to introduce what I'm wearing right now this is what I'm wearing right now this is so cute like look at the we love the skirts there's also pockets in like everything that they design basically which is so useful because we all need a good pocket. You can indeed fit a phone in these pockets. Cover it up with a skirt and it's like, it's not even there. <laughs> and okay, what am I wearing right now? The top is a basic padded workout cropped tank top in the blue spruce color. I am wearing size small. And the skirt is the everyday cloud full air crossover side pocket two in one tennis skirt. This color is called iguana and the skirt is an extra small. And funny thing about the skirt is that I actually purchased this skirt in white a while ago before I was sponsored by Halara and I think it's so comfortable and cute. So yeah, I just got another one in this green iguana color. Also, you guys, you know those like pink shorts that I wear all the time in my workouts? Like I wear these shorts every other day. I've gotten quite a few comments from you guys asking me where those shorts are from. And yes, those are indeed also from Halara. So if you want those pink shorts, now is your chance. Get them. <laughs> yeah, I will link Halara and also I'll put my discount code JamieF1 in the description box below so you don't forget and you can grab your 20% off. That's it for now. <laughs> Change. <laughs> So I'm actually heading out to the mall, just, I don't know, buying stuff. And I decided to change into this cut out twisted side pocket, two in one bar ballet dance dress. Color is forever blue, size is small. So yeah, I could fully do like an entire workout in this dress. Today, I'm gonna go to the mall. There's gonna be a lot of walking involved. I'm going to the mall. <laughs> you gotta understand that we get one chance, one chance. Hi guys, I am going to rollerblade for the first time in like a year. I'm kind of nervous. I hope I didn't forget how. <laughs> so hot. I think I forgot how to rollerblade. <laughs> Super fun. It was a really hot day though. <laughs> How did I do? You did great. You overcame your fears. I know, I was scared. It's scary to do something when you don't do it very often. It's like you think you forgot. For the first like five seconds, I felt like I forgot how to rollerblade. But then you like get back, <laughs> you get used to it. Oh no, I broke the seal. Oh well, I'm gonna drink the whole thing anyways. Just having a juice because I'm so hot, you guys. Cheers. I guess that kind of was a workout for today though. I said I was going to do a rest day today and then we just like spontaneously decided to a rollerblading. Definitely some good cardio, definitely some good legs. Is it like a traditional workout that you like turn on, roll your mat out and do? No, but it is an active activity. <laughs> and if most of your exercise looks like rollerblading or biking or going for walks, that's actually more than okay. That's amazing. <laughs> good morning, happy Sunday. Let's make some breakfast. I think I'm gonna gonna make a breakfast wrap this morning. I know I had one yesterday at Fresh. I guess we'll see which one is better. It's the battle of the breakfast wraps. <laughs> We're on. <laughs>
Okay, let's see how my wrap compares to the fresh wrap from yesterday. <laughs> Cheers. Mm. <laughs> as good as the fresh wrap was, I feel like real eggs and real sausage are just it. The Beyond Sausage though at Fresh was actually really good. The texture, like they got on point, the taste was really good. It was probably like the best Beyond meat that I've ever had. Mm -hmm. Anyways, gonna have breakfast. <laughs> So I've decided that I want to do Pilates today. We're gonna try something a little new. I mean like not new, but new for me. On Move With Nicole's channel, I see that she has a 30 minute full body power Pilates with weights workout. From the thumbnail, it looks like she's using, I don't know, maybe like two or three pounds, like very, very light dumbbells. And just using those to like add a tiny bit of weight to her Pilates practice, which is actually something I've never tried before. So yeah, I decided I want to try Try that and then today for our outfit check let me tell you what I'm wearing from Halara of course my top today is the cloud full padded v-neck cropped yoga tank the color is sandstone and if you know me this is like my color <laughs> I love stuff that is this exact color this is an extra small super comfortable all their workout tops are padded they do have pads in them so they're good for working out you don't have to wear anything like under them and for my bottoms today this is the Pat It Off Flow Crossover Side Pocket 2-in-1 Activity Skirt. Color is black, size is extra small. This fabric is called their Pat It Off fabric, and I believe this is their like pet fur friendly fabric. So if you have like a lot of fur floating around your house, which I do, <laughs> this fabric actually prevents like pet hairs from sticking onto it. But yeah, that's the outfit check for today. Let's do this Pilates workout. It's really crazy how much three pound dumbbells can add to your practice. <laughs> yeah, that burned. That was a really good Pilates workout. There were definitely a couple of exercises that were like, if I was doing this as like a weight training day, like a classic weight training day, I would do this exercise with a heavier weight. But in terms of like the Pilates practice today, the three pound dumbbells just they worked. I think it's because you're really putting those muscles into like a prolonged period of like holding of tension. You kind of need to use lighter weights. I think you would die if you use the weights that you normally do <laughs> for like chest presses, for example. That was a really good workout. I thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed that one. I'm definitely gonna have to look through Nicole's channel to see if she has other weighted workouts as well. Could be a new style that I just like fall in love with. <laughs> yeah, really liked it. See you guys later. What do you want for dinner, my baby do? Hey, away from the kitchen because I'm making some lemon curd. Cause I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm banned from the kitchen and I'm hungry. <laughs> Good have a lot of What am I, a minion? <laughs> Yeah, give me the chocolate. Mmm. <laughs> I'm so hungry. I've been eating a lot of vegan food this weekend. Vegan restaurants are fun to go to. Cause it's hard making vegan food at home when they get so creative in the restaurant. And they always use like ingredients that you don't have. Just some good old comfort food for dinner. Mmm. The hangriness is going away. Tonight. We are going to try the lemon curd that fiance made yesterday. Lemon curd yogurt bowl. Here we come. Ooh, that smells good. All right, there it is. Vanilla yogurt, lemon curd, granola, and blueberries. Get it all into one bite. <laughs> wow. Oh my god, that's actually delicious. 
It tastes like a lemon tart, but it'd be so good in a tart and like a pie or something. Yeah, so good. That workout that I just did was part of the Iron series. It was her like last full body day of that program. And I was doing the workout and I was like, I feel like I need to get heavier weights. Again, <laughs> I feel like I just recently started using those heavier ones. I think they're 22 pounds. And I was like doing my chest presses using those dumbbells. And I was like, I feel like this isn't even challenging anymore. <laughs> so yeah, we may have to buy new weights. We shall see. So today is Monday, but it's a long weekend here currently where I am. So I'm kind of treating today like Sunday. So I will meal prep today, but I just wanted to decide which pants to wear. <laughs> so both these options are from Halara, of course. First option here, I have crossover high-waisted back pocket super flare leggings. The color on this is brushed nickel and size extra small. So that's one option. Then our second option is the Cloudful Air high waisted drawstring side pocket plain full length joggers color is called gull and also in an extra small let's try these both and decide what to wear today option one these are the flare pant legging i think these are really cute wow they make my legs look like super long or something <laughs> yeah, these are definitely super cute, very comfy. I like how on the front here you get this kind of whatever this is called, the V. <laughs> the flare makes these like so comfortable, my gosh. Yeah, these are really cute. And we have option two. These are the joggers. They're very, very, very lightweight, my gosh. Goodness, they're definitely like a slim fit jogger like down here. It gets pretty like tapered like legging ish It's definitely like looser up here. You get a little more breathing room I like how these have pockets and also the drawstring here. These are a cute like lounge at home pant Yeah, they're kind of like a crossover between a jogger and a legging. I feel like these are more meal prep Type pants. So I'll go with the joggers today. Don't mind the classical music. Hope I don't get copyrighted. But this is what I made for this week's meal prep. It's like a Greek type Mediterranean pasta salad. I added black beans to this as well as chickpeas just for an extra boost. But the recipe I used from Half Baked Harvest. Taste test! The best part about meal prepping is tasting it. <laughs> oh, it's so good. The homemade dressing on this recipe just slaps. I love those Mediterranean flavors, like that olive feta. I could eat this whole pot right now. Oh my god, this is so good. Alright friends, I'm going to leave today's video right here. I hope you enjoyed spending the last couple of days with me. If you're struggling with like not being as consistent with your workout or needing to take weekends like off workouts or like more rest days in the summer, definitely don't worry about it. It's a normal thing. It happens to us all. But yeah, that's it for this one. Thank you to Halara again for sponsoring today's video. If you guys liked anything you saw, I will have all the links to the products in the description box down below. So definitely check that out. And again, I do have that 20% discount code. If you did like this video, please leave me a like and a comment. If you don't know what to comment down below, comment. We are doing amazing. If you like me, subscribe, do that bell thing, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!